Many people think that if they push enough of a person's buttons then they have some power over someone else. And the truth is you don't. At no time does your corporation employ you to anger someone on your job. At no time does your corporation employ you to piss on someone's rights, to purchase from your company. At no time do the vendors that invest billions of dollars in your organization allow you the right to violate their code of ethics which has no discrimination policies and non-harassment policies. And openly, at some point, all of your ideas about life could blow up in your face because you're not living your life. When you play those games on the job, you're saying, I don't want a better job. I don't seek better employment. I don't seek higher wages. And that's a lie. Almost everyone I know in adulthood wants the highest wage they can possibly get so that they can provide for themselves the best life possible while they're young and still able and agile. But after you get beyond those years, what are you doing with your bank account? Do you have money socked away for that rainy day? Are you going to be able to afford a retirement home? Are you going to be able to handle yourself in the places that you stay? Have you purchased a vehicle? Are you able to keep it through that period of time? How is your health going to be cared for? You see, when you're young, you can be foolish. You can play games, and you can be uppity, and you can be crass, and you can be all these things. Once you hit your 40s and 50s, you know what life is. And life is about work. And if you didn't choose well in your youth, if you didn't choose well in your 20s, it doesn't mean you can't still choose better. It just means you have to think a little differently. And you have to be able to scrimp and save and make cost-cutting decisions for your own situation.